I lost my hearing. I can only hear. I'm Uncle Les, and have I got a tall Jeep tale for you. I am Felix Constantino Villa Cataal. I was born January 13, 1959. I had I started this collection when I was before this I was my family. Before I was one year old, my grandfather. This is my mother and my father. And I am the only boy in the family. These are all my sisters. This one is her, this one is her, this one is her, this one is her. I started from the canals at the front. Mm -hmm. When I was still a young boy, it was still very clean. There were only 15,000 people living here. I'm sure Valencia was a, a small village really uh, at that time, yeah. The house was very clean, mm. so when there is a heavy downpour, mm, 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 as mm, the mm, sand mm. and the rock stumble, I used to pick up the marbles on the canal. A lot, a lot of lost marbles are in the canal. And when I pick up the marbles, I can find box magazine for the M1 carbine, shots, Mm -hmm. shells, mm -hmm. helmets, and grenades on the canal. Grenades. Because when the guerrillas will attack the Japanese position here, located in the school building, when they attack, they are, there are no trenches, so they use the canals as mm -hmm. their trenches, mm -hmm. and they fire everything. When everything is already fired, they retreat back to the hills because mm. the Maggette is just 15 minutes away and the reinforcements are coming. There right. are only 15 Japanese soldiers assigned here. Very interesting. That's a, that's a young age to yeah. be a collector, but I guess it would be very interesting at my, this age to see these strange metal my things. My father and was a policeman and my mother was a teacher. And my father started training me on how to use guns when I was still at a young age. The, I lost my hearing on the right ear because of a bullet I found in the canal. A 45 caliber peacemaker round, that big. Mm. So it, when I clean it, it got a hole. So my father put it into the sun to dry. When it was already dried, he put a, to cover the hole, he loaded it there. But only one bullet on the six mm. chambers. Mm. I was covering my ear like that. At first, it did not explode, so I removed the cover from here. And try again. When it exploded, it had a very loud sound that... I lost my hearing. I can only hear. Ding, 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 Oops. Ding. <laughs> Oops. Did you did you perforate your eardrum or? Yes, uh, may, maybe. But when I find rifles, I clean them, put around, and fire them without the stock. So I am tying them to the Y of the trees, tying them with rope. When it fires. The rope are cut because the sharp edges of mm. the rust mm -mm. cuts them. Mm -mm. My father even fired on the hole. It exploded and hit him here. The hole rifle <coughs> broke. It's, it's very dangerous, yes. yes. And I even <coughs> tried to hear the explosion of the 81 millimeter mortar. I do not have <coughs> nothing. So I just make a very big bonfire. When <coughs> the fire is already very big, I throw into the boat 
bone fire <coughs> and just head onto the big rocks. When it explodes, the earth I'm sure. crumbles just like an earthquake. <laughs> but you know what these things are for, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. That I am the one taking out all the diffusing everything mm -hmm. here. By yourself. Yes, and a lot of people who had bombs from their home, the grenades, they come here to make me open them. Did, Even the Did you have any training uh, to do no this? No training, but at the age of five when my when we were wedging out a cabinet of my mother in my grandmother's home, it was built in into the wall and we were wedging it out. I found a field manual mm. of booby traps and where you find them. Mm. So I do not know how to read during the time, but there are instructions there. In what you see, mm -hmm. they were all in Japanese and German bombs. Mm -hmm. But most of the bombs are similar. Mm -hmm. Whatever is man-made can be. This Un unmade. case history yes. of remains considered non-recoverable, non-recoverable, yeah, recoverable, non-recoverable case. This was his dental record. Mm -hmm. I have an American American soldier, but when I compared the dental records, it did not match. It so matter. this is not his. That is not his body. Right. This all came from team number two, statements. These are the affidavits mm. of four of his comrades on the day he died. It is the same story but a different name, affidavits of four mm -hmm. of his comrades mm -hmm. on the day he died. And this is the poem where he died. Or was last seen, yeah. Where private prescribed provincial body was last seen. This is the highest peak, Mount yes. Salinas. Yes. And this is over there, and he died here. I already have been there, and the Marines. So I, I would say that this is somewhere up above Casaroro. Yeah. No. Way far. Further, further, much further. Ah, I see. I because see. Talinis, Casaroro mm -hmm. is still here. Mm. That's the highest peak. Mm -hmm. Casaroro is right here. Mm -hmm. Turn over to the Japanese. 32 Japanese soldiers remains. Those in light blue are the Japanese veterans. Mm. These are the first 17 sets of Japanese soldiers remains. Is is this at the side of the shrine? At the shrine. Right. Yes. Ah, yes, I see, I see the pillar, yes. This is the shrine. This is the first batch. And this is the second batch. A lot of people are calling this pistols as winter pistols. But <laughs> these were issued to the pilots because uh, the pilots are wearing the gloves mm -hmm. and their fingers won't fit the under must, the, uh, the, the trigger must guard. The gloves, correct. Uh huh. They had very big trigger very guards. Very large trigger guards, yeah. Yeah, very large. Yeah. This is the magazine, 8 rounds, 8 mm. And this says it's uh, from the southern district. Um, Emperor 14th year? Yes, Nambu, 1925. Mm. That's a different design. Mm -hmm. This is a different design. This is the whole. This came from mm -hmm. Okinawa. Yes. That uh -huh. is for the pilot. Mm. This is for the army. This shrapnel here is Japanese. Mm -hmm. Those are the Japanese rounds for the 81 millimeter mortar. That was a mortar, a brand mortar made in France. Mm -hmm. But 
prior to the start of the Second World War, the Italians purchased a lot from France, mm -hmm. the Japanese purchased a lot from France, mm -hmm. the Americans purchased a lot from France. So, mm -hmm. wherever you go, it you, looks you, the same. You find the same, yeah. And that's an entry, anti uh, infantry uh, round. That is the Nakajima machine gun, 50 caliber. But it was just a copy of the Browning 50 caliber machine gun, mm -hmm. and the Japanese shortened the machine gun. Mm -hmm. Miniaturized and a spare barrel. Those are the dogtails of the Japanese. For their buttons. Uh, their meskets and their canteens uh, are just like similar to the German Wehrmacht. Mm -hmm. They would uh, touch your body and then go there. <laughs> but uh, kinda, you have some very good books. Those are long out of the I think. Yes. Yes. Gas mask filters from 1935. Gas mask filters 1939. Aluminum. Much lighter than the first. This is the smoke regulator mm -hmm. for this. Right. Yeah. During the but the uh, rubber was already deteriorating. Already rotted away. Yeah. This is the goggles here, right mm -hmm. here. The goggles. Ah, the eyepieces. Yeah. And the scraps for their gas mm -hmm. mask. This is already decayed. Uh, everything rotten. else is rotten, yeah. Yes. These are aluminum? Uh, maybe pewter? Uh, yeah, so they don't rust, the but, they, but they still corrode a little bit, yeah. This is marked with this, Hunbo Punahase, in Japanese. So, Hunbo is headquarter office, yes. and Punahase is the name, the family name of the owner. A Type 2 transceiver, wow. This is an ometer, mm. and this is a tester. Mm -hmm. It is made in the United States, but I found this together with the Japanese equipment. Okay. They were using American, using American technology. Equipment. Yep. Those are the old transistors. Yep. This is the hand generator for this. For the, for the radio set. To yep. give the power. The power. Yep. The valves. Yep. American 40 mm, mm -hmm. the woofers, American anti aircraft, 37, 37 mm, mm, Japanese, mm -hmm. 25 mm, the American Browning machine gun, 12.7 mm, the Japanese, 13.25 mm, but all of the Japanese, they are all in. Double action. When it hits you, it explodes. Other explosive rounds. Right. Filled with explosives. Mm -hmm. The Japanese was already low in their weapons. That they were taking the machine guns from their airplanes. Right. To fight the Americans. Some are made in Tokyo and some are made in Okinawa. Mm -hmm. Ah, no, not Okinawa. This is the American 30 caliber, the M1 Garand, the uh -huh. Japanese bullets, Japanese bullets for that machine gun. This <coughs> is a box magazine for the Browning automatic rifle. I found it just like this, still with the bullets. Intact. But when I remove the bullets, it just looked like that. It so apart. I never no, removed no, no, the bullets don't, here. Don't take it apart. No. <laughs> no, it's only the dirt holding it together. Yes. And where, where did you find that? In the battlefield. Up there on the mountain. Yes. You see, that's very rusty. That is. Nobody kept this. It was just lying on the just, ground. Just abandoned, yes. Abandoned. Yeah. The mortars. Wow. This is the shrapnel for the conventional bombs. When it explodes. This one separates. Mm -hmm. So these are all uh, of these ro are rocket mortars. Yes, right. And this unexploded shell, mm. only the tip. The tip of this. It is from Rifles, 1917 model. Mm -hmm. I just 
rebuilt it. That looks very clean. Because if I do not rebuild it, the stock is already gone. Yep. All of it is gone already. Yep. Decay. Yeah, it will be all eaten away. Yeah, even the bayonets are already very. And the Japanese easy. does not have a factory for these bullets. Mm -hmm. That the bullets there are refilled with lead. Ah. Right, so they reload their own brass, yeah. I, I have a photograph of one uh, that was dropped on Cebu. It's a little bit different this uh, is from this one. In yep. English, yep. this is in Chinese. The rest is in it Japanese, is actually, including yes. the back. That is all in Japanese. Yep. Yep. The surrender document. And can I read that? Hang on. You can read the English. I can read the Chinese. The English is here. The bearer of the past is surrendering. He probably, probably does not understand, understand English, English, but mm -hmm. he has been instructed to follow your signs. Mm -hmm. Treat him courteously and conduct him to headquarters by order of the commanding officer. Yep. Yes. And the instruction here is to fold it at the line. To fold down the line. And when they see the American soldiers, they put it under Hold their head the card. and they are waving of the mm -hmm. Japanese generator. And that is uh, the Japanese marking set. Yep. Small generator set, gas tank. I did not find the... Uh, I did not find the... Uh, the generator. Engine. Mm. The generator is here. Ah, uh, I see. Broken. Yeah, yeah. The, uh, this is the... Damage broken. Carburetor for that engine. That's the carburetor, yeah. Carburetor. Broken. Yeah. Did, did you find these helmets yourself? Yes. Those are not bullet holes. I only have mm, one they with a bullet they're, hole. They're rusty, yeah. And those are not real skulls. Those are just plastic for the Halloween. Yeah. Our concern was Tio Nene, younger brother of my mother who was with the, in fam the famous Philippine Scout Artillery Battalion was among the 70,000 or so Filipino and American prisoners there were 50,000 Filipino and mm. 20,000 Americans mm -hmm. that surrendered yep. that surrendered in uh, 42 yes and he was my cousin our mothers were sisters so he wrote it here uh, uh, yes. the to museum Right, but he did not know. He just tells them uh, 15 years. Yeah, that is 50 years. Actually, it's 50 years. More than 50 years, not 15. Yeah, there we are. Ron Samara. Okay, we'll have to look that up. We're burning them. You can see mm. the firewood. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this is the cleaner here. Mm -hmm. It was crumpled by the squad. Fire. But and the cr crushed in the fire. The cleaner yeah. for yeah. the rifles. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let's take the Americans were afraid that the Filipinos with all the guns left into the hills that they will do a revolution. So they were yep. burning yep. the rifles. Yep. My father yeah, things like this. The was started his career as a policeman in March of 1942. Mm -hmm. In March of 1943, he joined the guerrillas. But near the end of the war, as all of the people in the lowlands had guns and grenades, bombs, and the fighting was already in the hinterlands, Going in the mountains. he was recalled back into his old post mm -hmm. as a policeman to mm -hmm. keep the peace. Mm -hmm. So he had no record of mm, being mm, a soldier. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. So he was an unrecognized group. And he yep. was captured by the Japanese. Yep. Ferdinand Marcos and Emilda. Yeah. Oh, yes. The Battle of Polo. Mm. This is Russian. MacArthur and Osminia. Mm. Yeah. The medal, the 40th anniversary of Negros and City or resistance against mm. the Japanese. Mm. 
That is a hand transit. Oh. It came from the tunnel. Going to the pier area from Selima. This is an artillery. Special services, U.S. Army. After the battle, they also dance to the local maiden. Mm. So that is special services, U.S. Army. Working scariest for the G. Yes. Look at this. Water purification. The water pump. Yep. Water source. Put them there. When it is already filtered, they put mm -hmm. the halasun mm -hmm. to kill the bacteria. Right. When you pump this, ah uh, yes. One minute. Ah uh, yes. And that was still one can. One pint of water. There was not a lot of this made because for every platoon, only one carries this. Mm. There you go. Yeah. Dear old dad. June, December 9, 1941. That is two days after Pearl Harbor. Because Pearl Harbor was December 7, Sunday. Right. This is Tuesday, December yep. 9. And that's the famous so return of the In the landing in Leyte, uh, about estimate of 250,000 men in landing. Yep. This is the shrapnel of the same bomb. Yep. This part is this. Mm -hmm. And you can see that part on top of that. Right. Yep, that's your carrier killer bomb. Yeah, interesting. 60 millimeter motors. These are all Americans here, except yeah. the Japanese helmet. Is that another thousand pounder? Yes. Where did, where did you get those? I found nine of this in the battlefield. My God, I found yeah. nine of this and only one 500 pound. Mm. The 500 pound stuck on a big tree, just like that. But the theory was what comes from above, oh, the branches mm -hmm. breaks, fall down together with the bomb. But that was a very big tree and it just and after and there. 75 years, the tree had grown and it just caught the, caught the bomb there. Wow. So you have to cut one branch to make it full. But that is still loaded. Mm. <laughs> yeah. It has to yeah. detonator. Yeah. yeah. Oh, very dangerous. Very dangerous.